course, tomorrow is Halloween night, and while the coronavirus has canceled a lot of events this year, people have come up with several ways to be more creative when it comes to trick-or-treating despite this pandemic. Thanks for joining us here tonight. I'm Brooke Ludington. And we're going to go out to our Dan Garrett now. He is live with some new ways to safely trick-or-treat. Dan? Yeah, Brooke, I reached out to viewers on my Facebook page to see which ways they were coming up with to deliver candy safely this year. And I got to say, they came up with some pretty creative ideas. Now, the first one I'm going to demonstrate here is the candy shoot. Now, we've seen a lot of this going around on the Internet, but you can get pretty creative with it or go simple. This one, all it is is wrapping paper roll. So what you do is you put your candy in on one end and then stand far away from someone and let it drop right into their candy basket. Now, the whole point of this is to keep socially distant from one another. Okay. okay. Edna okay. Robb and her family are preparing for a Halloween unlike one they've had before. The normal one, we will be at 45th and Gage at Topeka Baptist, and that's where we would normally have the um, chunk or treat. But this year, that's not happening. Instead, Rob is improvising. We didn't want it to be spoiled because of um, COVID-19. So we just decided to um, social distance, of course, and put candy up on a card table. They decorated their table and even added some hay to make it look more festive. Trick-or-treaters will be able to walk up and grab a piece without having to interact. One idea a viewer sent me was to tape candy to a pumpkin and for the kids to rip off their own. One family even went to the extreme and made a self-dispensing candy machine. And if you don't feel comfortable trick-or-treating at all this year, the CDC suggests to do a candy scavenger hunt at home. Rob says she bought less candy this year because she expects less trick-or-treaters. Yeah, I really don't know uh, what people are planning on doing because of COVID-19. But for the off chance they do, they want the candy to be delivered okay. safely. 